Valentine's Day just around the corner. We got a couple of great projects here at Discovery Point in Udawa. Got lead teacher Brittany Chambers here to talk about three very simple ideas that are great for any age that are going to certainly yep. make mom or the loved one in your life very happy. So let's get started with the first one over here. All right, so the first one is we're making coffee filter hearts. Okay. All right, so you're going to take your coffee filter and you're going to fold it in half. All right. And then you're going to cut out like a half of a heart. Half of a heart. Okay, I'll try to do as best I can. Of course, you know, parents can obviously do this for their kids as well if they're not very familiar with scissors yet. All right, so we got that. How'd I do? That look okay? Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's kind of a big heart. It makes fun. Okay, I have a big heart. It's a big All right. heart. Okay, what do we do now? And you're going to take <laughs> markers, and you can use either Valentine's Day colors, or you can use natural colors that you come in the boxes. Color yep. as best we can. You can just scribble on there. All right, go scribble away here. Got a little bit of pink here. Having a daughter, there's a lot of pink in my life now. Throw in a little bit of dark red as well. And of course, they can color the entire thing, mm -hmm. make designs. They can also make a shape or two yep. or draw something. All right, what do we do now? And then you can take the spray bottle and you'll put it on the table and just spray. And this is the key here because mm -hmm. why are we using a spray bottle? With the spray bottle, it'll bleed all the colors together and then you can hang it up after it dries and let the sun shine through it or hang it up over a light. Huh, okay, yeah, I can see where it sort of bleeds and then you can kind of let the wind, yeah, I mm -hmm. like that. Pretty good little idea. All right, so we're done with that one here. We're gonna move on to our next one. Never heard of a, a concept like this, <laughs> using white crayons and white piece of paper. <laughs> All right, so this one is the mystery message. So you can get your kids to write, or you can write for them a message, or you can just let them draw, depending on their age. Okay. And you can just draw whatever you want to draw. You can put and in then, a, I love you as well yeah, if you, you want to do that. Yeah, you can write that. I guess I'll do that right quick. Earn some brownie points. All right. And then you'll take your washable watercolors. Okay. And you'll just paint over them. Ah, and you can see the message in mm -hmm. there. And you can let the kids, and the fun thing about this is the kids can paint the whole page. We'll try that. Okay, go ahead. And the message will still pop up. So even if they want to go crazy with paints, it'll still show the whole message. All right, put a little bit of orange in here. I'm making some funky colors here. All right. Do one last little here so we can't see the... Uh, I love you in there, so there you go. I can barely see it, but I love you, and let that dry, that's a mm -hmm. little project as well. Awesome little ideas here, something that any age can do, and something that the dads can do <laughs> with their kids as well. Yes, I'm counting on you dads. Brittany, we certainly do appreciate it, and of course, uh, Discovery Point as well, here in Udawa for letting us come down and, and uh, learn about a couple great little ideas and projects for Valentine's Day. All right, I want to thank Discovery Point in Udawa for letting us come on down to my daughter's pre-K class. We had a lot of fun.